what my life is consist of now. Nine to five, 40 hours a week, unloading, loading, unloading a truck. It was this close, I swear, it was this close of killing myself. Until I heard my neighbor's phone ring because I don't got a fucking phone because other companies I work for don't pay me enough. And it was Luchacor on the phone. I said, who the fuck is Luchacor? Gage, we want you to come in and face Super Oprah. I said, I got a job. I'm good. Then I thought about it. Super Oprah. What I could do to this guy is, I could beat the fucking living shit out of him, kick him in his nuts, and I got a job with Luchacor, because I heard the guys running Luchacor got money. I heard their bankroll is high. I need money. So what I'll do is, you shut the fuck up, asshole. Is I'm gonna burn this truck for fucking insurance money. I'm gonna go out and get me new gear, show up at Lucha Corps, kill him, slay him, and pin him. Or I can go back 40 hours a week working in a piece of shit like this. I'd rather murder someone. I'd rather be in fucking prison with three hots and a cot and a bunch of faggots running around than work 40 hours a week, nine to five. So Super Oprah, I have no clue who the hell you are. This is not personal, it's business. I'm gonna slice your throat. Jones here. I'm joined at this time once again by Mr. Saul Steinberg. Saul, we got a hell of a hard-hitting matchup in Nick Gage versus Super Oprah. Yeah. Listen here, New Gingrich. Not only am I not sure what to make of this match, I am not sure what to make of Super Oprah. Well, I'll tell you what, don't let that dress fool you. Super Oprah is one tough customer, raunchy, dirty brawler, will do whatever it takes. Debuted back in 99. You never know what to expect from him or her. her? Shim. Shim is what I'm going with. Shim. Shim. I like that. I like it. Another 
one of the Lucha Cora originals, making Shin's way out to the Northeast. And, uh, oh my. Looks like Shahid will fit in quite well out here. I mean, you know, not for nothing. Oh my. That's, uh, that's at least five to eight dollars worth right there. Uh, you know, depending upon which bus stop you're at. But uh, wow. Nick F. Engage versus Super Oprah. The king of ultra violence is wow. I uh, both of these, both of these. Well, wait. Look at wait. Nick Gage's face. Let's put it this way: the one guy and the one question mark have both been in this business for a good solid ten years. Oh. Oh my. He almost knocked the weave off. Oh, there we go. My. Oh, Super Oprah not taking kindly to somebody messing with. Look at these big these over weaves. Leapfrog. Oh, woo. Look, boost. Look at that. Right to Nick Gage's face. Nick Gage, I don't know if he knew what he was getting into, but Super Oprah just let him know. Gage charges in with that big forearm and dumps Oprah to the outside. And that took all of about 30 seconds, some odd. Boom! Gage is out the ring oh and he's got God. the chair. Super Oprah catches one in the dome piece and that brought us down. Trio of chair shots and they're stalking him, him her with a cooler. And again, introduced her to the front row. My God. Folks, we've seen a myriad of matches so far. Luchacore delivering as promised. Here is the hardcore. Absolutely. These guys are already brawling their way into the crowd. Think about all the people you've seen brawl in the crowd in this building, Newt. Oh, absolutely. And now you can add Nick Gage and Super Oprah to that list. Personally, for me, I'll be adding Super Oprah. Gage, I've seen him drag opponents all throughout this time. Unbelievable. I, I, I have to communicate. I am concerned for Super Oprah's welfare. And judging by the look of that dress, Super Oprah is on welfare, because that is a trifling, trifling piece of clothing she's got on right there. Oh, my. Got dumped over onto the bleachers there. Don't sell Oprah short. Like I said, one tough customer. Oh, my. That throws Gage through the crowd, driving him head first through all those rows of chairs. Oh, and what a headbutt. You know what they do say, hell hath no fury like a woman scorned. I'm not sure what they say about transgenders, but I'm sure the scorn is comparable at the very least. I'll give you that, yes. I, I can't argue that. That's sad logic to me. Both of these guys now. Oh, uh, I'm sorry, the guy and the lady making their way back into the ring. Oh. One of the least desirable places somebody could wind up would be between Super Oprah's legs. Nick Gates, surprise, has a chair. Oh, and that chair wound up between Super Oprah's eyes. And Super Oprah probably has a concussion right now. Good God, that's got to be it. But Gage, it. Gage isn't going for the cover. No, not at all. Gage is not even close to being done. Think about how confused Super Oprah was beforehand. After that shot, Super Oprah's gonna wake up and still be confused about whether he's a man, he's a woman, somewhere in between. Wait a minute. Oh Nick Gage. My. Oh my. Trash can over Super Oprah's head. Fox right in the right in the skull with that. He was beating him her with a boot just a second ago. And, and they are brawling. It's starting to get out of my line of sight here, but wow, wow, look at Super this. Oprah. Absolutely opening up, teeing off on Gage. I can barely see him now. All right, we have officially lost sight, but I can hear the carnage from here, and there is no doubt in my mind that these two are beating the ever-living daylights out of each other. Spilled back into the locker room. I don't know what's going to come of this matchup. I'll tell you what's going to come. I would not be surprised if within moments we start hearing ambulances. That German suplex, beautiful. And oh my, Nick Gage and Super Oprah have found their way back to the ringside area. What's going on here? These kids better run for their lives. My God, oh, oh, look at this. Oh, he takes a choke break from Nick Gage. Slater getting out of dodge. Wait a 
second. And he takes. Oh! oh just took another choke breaker from Super Oprah. Slater absolutely just fed RV1 to the Wolves. And it oh looks my! Like they're picking up right where they left off. Super Oprah comes charging in. Big Larry. Gage is down. Oprah on the hop. This. Both going to the outside again. Oprah introduces him to the steal. Once again, knee strike. And Super Oprah got control, revs his head right into the stairs. Were these two guys brawling the entire time we were at intermission? I, th I think they were. We were gone for a good 15 minutes. Where the hell did they go? Probably up to Argon Ave. Oh, chair shot to the back. Just shrugs it off. Oh, and that's how it's done. Chair shot to the head. Oh my God. Shot after shot with that chair. Hammering right him now, like a nail. Right now, I'm going to say that Nick F. Engage is a national treasure for what he is doing to Super Oprah right now. I do not like Oprah Winfrey. Oh my. Well, this is Super Oprah. Different Oprah. entity. But still, Oprah is an Oprah to me. What, what, what is an Oprah? Uh, I don't sure. even know what a Super Oprah is. Tranny? We, well, that's all conjecture. We have no idea. All I know is this is one tough individual. What is he doing? Oh, and what an elbow drop. From the second rope to the floor, and Super Oper was... What was once a table's now splinters. Absolutely right, Salaman. And he was just laying prone right on top of that table. And now he's laying on the floor here in the arena. If Gage can get him back in the ring, that might be it. Gotta think, absolutely. Oh, Lauderdale over to check on Oprah now. Super Oprah hasn't moved. What's Gage to Oh, oh my! An innocent victim. I think he just threw the timekeeper into Super Oprah. Talk about wrong place, wrong time. Gage now rolling Super Oprah back into the ring. Oh, good God. I think we've seen this before. Somebody's got a dirty face. Oh! Face wash. Absolutely brutal. Now listen to these fans. Took the words right out of them, out of my mouth. I was about to say, what a brutal face wash there. Oh, and what an arrogant cover. Three. That's it.